Since rapper King Von was killed in November 2020, life for rapper Quando Rondo has been pretty miserable. From losing career opportunities to getting dissed on every track, and worst of all, the constant death threats and attacks on his life. He recently found himself in a shootout that took his friend's life. The incident has left fans questioning why his life is still being threatened. Keep watching till the end of this video to see why Quando Rondo was really shot at. Trust me, you don't want to miss this. Quando Rondo Shot At Rapper Quando Rondo found himself in yet another shootout, but like always, he managed to escape without a scratch. Unfortunately, his friend, Lol Pab, was killed in the incident. At about 5 p.m. on August 19th, the LAPD received several calls that a shooting had happened near the intersection of Beverly Boulevard and La Cienega Boulevard. The victims were at a gas station when three men in a white vehicle pulled up right in front of the rapper's black Cadillac Escalade and opened fire at La Cienega and Beverly Boulevards. Quando Rondo, who was driving the car, was able to make it out of the gas station as he drove a few blocks away to West Hollywood, where the authorities were called. The account of the Los Angeles County Sheriff's Department states that the victims of the shooting, Quando Rondo and his friend, drove to the intersection of Santa Monica and San Vicente Boulevards where they called out for help from law enforcement officers. On getting to the scene, they discovered that one of the victims was already in critical condition. Los Angeles Police Department Lieutenant John Radke said that the three suspects were now on the run. He also added that there wasn't any interaction or exchange between Quando Rondo and the shooters. They just showed up and began shooting. We don't know why or how this happened. All we know is that the victim's vehicle, they pulled up, they were pumping gas, and it looks like they probably finished pumping gas, and the suspects approached from the alley, got out of the car, and started shooting at those victims. Lieutenant John Radke told a news outlet. One of Quando Rondo's reps released a statement about him saying, Quando was present during a shooting yesterday evening, which resulted in the untimely death of another young man's life. He himself didn't sustain any injuries during the shooting and is safe. We ask that his privacy is respected at this time. As soon as the news hit the media, a woman who claimed to be Quando Rondo's aunt shared an update via her Instagram story about him where she wrote, Maybe I should reword it. He's fine. I spoke with him myself. A couple of minutes after sharing the post, followed up with another post where she seemed upset. The woman wrote, I know y'all are concerned, but please stop calling me. Please understand I can't talk to him and not none of the people I need to be talking to for him if y'all keep calling. I just kept answering because I think y'all him. Please stop. Suspects of the shooting incident Although with proper investigations, the authorities should be the ones in charge of announcing the perpetrators of this crime, the social media streets carry on just fine without them getting involved, and from the looks of it, fans have begun calling out Lil Durk and his OTF crew as suspects in this crime against Quando Rondo's life. Shortly after the shooting was announced, a rapper from Oblock, The Bands, replied to a tweet from Say Cheese TV saying, a f goofy, his should have died 100%. Other Oblock rappers also sent subtle jabs at Quando Rondo after the attack, so it shouldn't be surprising that the OTF crew or members of Oblock would have had a hand in this. You see, since King Von died in 2020, Quando Rondo has had to look over his shoulders everywhere he goes. He's had promoters drop him for fear that the OTF crew would attack them, and he's even had the mayor cancel his shows because they fear that there might be retaliation from the Oblock gang to avenge King Von's murder, and an incident could lead to multiple casualties. All that and Quando Rondo getting shot several times after King Von's death has made fans point their fingers at Lil Durk's OTF crew and Oblock. To top it off, Quando Rondo has pissed off Lil Durk several times, from releasing diss tracks to attack Lil Durk, and even going as far as suggesting that he may have had a hand in Lil Durk's brother, D Thang's death. This has caused Lil Durk and Quando Rondo to be at loggerheads for the longest, so it's no surprise that fans think Lil Durk is getting back at Quando Rondo. Quando Rondo and Lil Durk's beef. 
Lil Durk and Quando Rondo have beeped with each other in the past, and they've even subbed one another on diss tracks. Quando Rondo began with the dissing when he released a music video with an image of Lil Durk. Quando Rondo was called out after releasing a music video for his single, Soul Reaper, with a Lil Durk lookalike, who he appears to sneak up on and shoot. After fans called him out for dissing Lil Durk, Quando Rondo set the record straight with a post on his Instagram story where he wrote, These fans make anything up. Don't even be thinking like that. In June of 2021, a snippet of Lil Durk's album with Lil Baby was leaked. The leaked songs revealed that Lil Durk was sending threats to Quando Rondo due to King Von's murder. In the tracks, Lil Durk took shots at several of his ops, including FBG Duck, Lil Tim, and Quando Rondo. And we took L's for sure, but in Chicago, they know we win in for sure. You do it for what? Better not say that you do it for gunshots. Them be tough. That The moment he ran and he knew he ain't ducked and his out of luck. We do it for Vaughn. We don't wait till it dies down. We load and we do it tomorrow. Lil Durk appeared to take shots at Quando Rondo, who had just at the time released an interview that he filmed with Angela Yee inside a Rolls Royce. Lil Durk said, That Rolls better be bulletproof, Lil. You know we gon' shoot at the stars, he rapped. In October 2021, Quando Rondo released the track Time Spent, where he said, Looks like that dissing in them songs got your brother killed. Lil Durk has been known to brag about his dead ops in his music, so at that time, there was some speculation that D Thang's tragic incident may have been linked to his music. Quando Rondo added in the song, Not even a million bucks can change the way your mother feels. While the rapper didn't mention D Thang by name, fans of both rappers were convinced that Quando Rondo's lyrics were subtle jabs at Lil Durk. Quando Rondo's Previous Shootings this isn't the first time Quando Rondo has found himself in a shooting. One of the very first incidents that he survived was the shooting that happened on the night King Von was killed. Quando Rondo was present in the brawl, but he escaped without getting shot. However, he's had to look over his shoulders since that day, especially since his attack in 2021. In May 2021, while Quando Rondo and his crew made a stopover at a convenience store, some gunmen pulled up on them and began shooting at them. The incident happened at about 3 a.m. that fateful night when he was traveling through Atlanta, where he had performed a concert. Although the rapper wasn't injured, one of his guys sustained a bullet wound to the hand. The authorities claimed it was a premeditated drive-by attack, as Quando Rondo and his guys had not been in the store for up to 10 minutes before the shooting began. Do you think Lil Durk had a hand in Quando Rondo's shooting? Join the conversation and let us know in the comments section below. That's the end of today's video, guys. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to subscribe for more content. Also, don't forget to smash that like button and leave a comment down below. Thanks.